Hello! Um, I just watched Zoe's video, um, which was brilliant, and I don't have any scales myself, um, and I've never thought about using the bath <laughs> um, as a way of measuring weight loss. So thank you for that, Zoe. Um, that was, oh, so funny. Um, yeah. So I'm hoping this one kind of um, fits in with what I said in my introduction, um, follows on a bit, um, because it's kind of um, about changing your point of view to enable yourself to make the positive changes to everything else, to everything external. Um, so I want to share something which I've written. I really like to write um, and very often I just write things down and put them in the bin. Um, occasionally they get shoved into the back of a drawer um, just in case of posthumous fame. I'm joking. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, so this is also about stepping out of my comfort zone. So even though actually I'm just reading a poem and putting it on the internet, which doesn't really seem like a lot, it is quite far out of my comfort zone. Um, I mean, I haven't just bought a Southwest Day ticket and gone to Bridgewater. I've had to use a passport to get this far away, for sure. In fact, I don't even think I'm in the EU anymore. Um, I probably have to apply for a visa. So, yeah. Um, so this is about acceptance really, um, uh, that's not to say accepting things as well, this is what it is, there's nothing I can do about it, um, not at all, but just accepting yourself because I think if you don't um, it makes it difficult to make the, make the improvements that you want to. Um, so yeah, here it is, um, to look down here a little bit because that's where the words are. Okay, <clears throat> this body is not media beautiful. This face has been painted to cover its flaws, and whose line between fine and flaw is drawn. This face is assumed imperfections disguised by a wealth of products and a superficial smile. This torso is etched with a map of directions, marked as the journey to birth from conception. We sold oils and creams, creams to erase these lines, to keep this damaged skin covered up at all times. These breasts are not how they were at 19. They're not perfect in size or symmetry. These breasts aren't the ones you see on page three, but they fed life and health to two human beings. These legs are stubbly, rarely clean shaven. These legs aren't trying to make a statement. It's just that these hands preoccupied by life never seem to find the time. This figure provokes, when's the baby due? I turn down seats on buses and places in queues. With my awkward reply, embarrassment ensues. Thank you, but my babies are seven and two. This body is the product of a stormy mind that needs to find the strength and courage to be kind, not to tar its lungs with nicotine addiction, not to block its arteries whilst blocking out emotion. Take an image of this body on Photoshop. Where do you begin with an airbrush? When do you stop? Fuck that. Fuck what the world has come to expect. Give credit where credit's due and accept. That was it. Bye.